All right, guys, this is what we're going to learn today, how to do your own template with the MPC. So first thing you do is go to new. Um, as you can see, you have an empty canvas. My instrument is MPC, so you don't, I guess you don't have to find it. But if you are looking for it, go to AU instruments, Kai professional, MPC. Don't use stereo, use multi output 16 stereo. All right. Click that. Uh, remember, it's a software instrument so create one track so this is what comes up when you have one track um first thing you should do is go to your mixer window so on your regular window your midi form your software window you won't have the plus minus but on your mixer window you will so let's take out everything else all right so you have your mixer window right here so what we're going to do is try to put some sounds in there so you can actually see what's going on. Um, let's see. I'm just going to load up any program, actually. How about that? I'll just load up any one. I don't care. There we go. We got claps, kick, whatever. I don't care. I don't use this. Anyways. Um, so the first thing you should do is go to the MPC mixer, channel mixer, um, click on that, you bring this up a little bit so that way you see what you have, or you can go to the pad mixer. The channel mixer is from each program, so I can directly just send out whatever's on my program straight to the mixer and separate each one or I could go to each pad and separate as you should know um, so we're going to do the pad mixer which is right here this is your other mixer channel mixer it's your pad mixer um, so the first track let me see oh by the way you can also tap this little button right here and it'll give you the actual um, sound uh, pad Okay, so let's go back. Let's say we want this kick to be by itself, right? So I want to send it to maybe stereo output 3, 4. I want to send this clap to 5, 6. And then I want to send this hi-hat 7, 8. And this other hi-hat. Uh, stereo. Make sure it says stereo output, guys. Make sure it's stereo output. 7, 8, 9, 10. So we'll just do that for now. So you could go back to your mixer on Logic. Right there. Right? And you press the plus sign. 1, 2, 3, 4. So you know 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So each time I press a function, it will go in its own channel mixer and right here is where you can EQ it you can do whatever you want to it um, audio effects you could do all of that stuff but yeah this is the short tutorial of how to get your MPC into logic and to separate each track um, yeah, we'll talk more about how to export your tracks another time, but that's how you do it. Thanks.